Today we shall look at an example relating to notation and cash flow diagrams and tables. And let's see the variables that are in the equation for the cash flow diagram. You have a small i represents the interest, the interest rate, the n is the number of years, the p is the present value, f is the future value, and a is the end of period payment. They are always equal. Now let's look at the diagram here in figure 4-2. If you look at the diagram, you see P, which is an investment, <coughs> you invest $17,000 now at a 1% interest for four years. After four years, we'll receive $17,690. Now, let me explain the figures, the, 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 the notation in the figure. <coughs> because we are investing 17000 we are spending money, so we plot it downward. You see, P is below the date and below the zero. So now, since we're spending money, we plot the 70000 downward on the diagram. Since we're receiving money, after four years, we plot the F upward over the, over the data. And you see the number of years, one, two, three, four, and N represents the number of years, and I represent the number of months. So every time you have an investment and you're spending money, you always plot it downward. Anytime you're receiving money, you plot it upwards. I look at another example again. Example 4-1. In this example, we have uh, 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 a proposed investment uh, that uh, the company wants to wants to undertake. They want to invest ten thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars, and the annual revenue will be five thousand three hundred ten dollars for five years, and will have a market recovery value of two thousand dollars at the end of, of year five. At the end of year five, they receive that two thousand dollars. Now the annual expenses. On our investment is three thousand dollars at the end of each year for operating and maintaining the project. Now the question is, we must draw the cash flow diagram for this situation. When you look at the diagram again. You see the ten thousand dollars is plotted downward at year zero. So since it is an investment, the company will be spending money, so we plot it downward in the diagram. So you see the ten thousand dollars with the arrow plotted down below the, the datum. Now as you go along the cash flow, you see uh, 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 an annual revenue. Revenue is something that comes to you. Okay, comes to you. So the revenue that comes to the company for five years is five thousand three hundred ten dollars. So it's plotted upward. Every year you receive five thousand three hundred. Every year five thousand three hundred. Every year, five thousand two hundred. You see, product upward. Now, every company got expensive. The annual expenses every year they spend three thousand dollars. You see, the three thousand dollar product below the data. Three thousand, three thousand, three thousand for four years. Okay, that how you represent money when it's coming from when you're spending money. Three thousand. Now, the problem also says at the end of the fifth year. They have a market recovery value. An example of a market recovery could be you have a car after four or five years, you want to buy a new one so you can sell it to your friend for, for maybe 25% of the amount of money you pay to, to, to buy it at the, at the original stage. So at the end, the market recovery is $2,000 after five years. So since they'll be coming to the company, you plot it upwards. You see a plot it upwards on the diagram. Okay.